Hello, I'm Dr. Robert Morris, president of the Helen Keller Foundation. Floaters are opacity in the vitreous gel of the eye. Millions of people notice floaters, but relatively few seek treatment. Recent articles have suggested measuring vitreous opacities and their symptoms to help assess floater severity. In this article, I show that floater patients' own words best identify those needing vitreous opacity removal by vitrectomy. Here are several instances of vitreous opacity removal by vitrectomy narrated with patients' own words. I have to blink repeatedly when my vision is blocked or blurred. The floaters pass by and my vision comes back into focus. I can't read street signs before they pass by. I compensate by memorizing signs I would normally be able to read. There's a continual snow globe effect with debris swirling around every time my eyes move. Grayish brown debris-like horse hair in dirty water. I swerved to avoid something while driving that wasn't really there. It was a scary moment. I'm very cautious when going downstairs, so I've had a second railing placed to have one on each side. I feel like my eyes are having a bobblehead dance as I read and I eventually give up reading. Areas of unfocus move in and out of my vision in both eyes all the time. They are always grabbing my attention, making me lose my train of thought. I can see on an eye test after staring at letters for a while, but I can't see effectively when it matters in my daily life. My eye doctor said there wasn't anything to do that people just live with floaters. What should have been a sunny day was overcast for me. Ironically, the more light I'm exposed to, the less I can actually see. I struggle in sunlight, and I've almost walked in front of a car because I didn't see it, even after looking in that direction. I'm continually trying to clear my forward vision without success, with everything moving around all the time. The blurring comes and goes day to day, but I can never find a pattern for it. When I move my eyes from left to right, the floaters move in the opposite direction. They move at different speeds and new ones come into my line of sight when I least expect them. As the floaters move around, I lose the thread of a sentence I'm reading. Vitreous opacity vitrectomy now has a safety profile similar to cataract extraction. For more information, visit floaterstories.com and thank you.